Question number three. A client admitted is suspected of having Bell's palsy. Which of the following signs and symptoms would the nurse expect to note in the client? A, a tingling sensation of the eyelids. B, burning pain in the nose with intermittent facial paralysis. C, speech or chewing difficulties accompanied by facial droop. Or D, a stabbing facial pain with intermittent tingling sensation in the eyes. Looking at these answer options, option A, tingling sensation of the eyelids, a tingling sensation is not a characteristic sign or symptom in patients with Bell's palsy. In option B, a burning pain in the nose with intermittent facial paralysis, this is also not a sign of Bell's palsy. In option C, speech or chewing difficulties accompanied by facial droop, Bell's palsy is a one-sided, in most cases, facial paralysis from compression of the cranial nerve 7. There is a facial droop from paralysis of the facial muscles, increased lacrimation, speech and chewing difficulties, and painful sensations of the eyes, in the face, or behind behind the ear, making this answer option correct. In option D, stabbing facial pain with intermittent tingling sensations in the eyes, Bell's palsy is usually not associated with pain, especially not in the eyes. So again, the correct and final answer option here would be C.